Oh, this should be pretty simple. There we go. How easy was that? Instant kill on a war chief. That is sick. Yeah, boy. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. Alright, so this the plan for this video right here is to um, kill the rest of the war chiefs that, for the main story. And um, as you can see right here, the war chiefs are the guys standing on these big blocks. And to get the identity of the war chief and his whereabouts and how to bring him out, you need to interrogate one of his bodyguards. And you can see the lines there, the, the line coming from that bodyguard on the left hand side here, they're, the, they're his bodyguards. So we got this guy here, and he's going to be in a like a side mission here, where he's going to be what's he doing? Invade the execution to weaken Sauron's army. So I'm guessing he's executing someone. So if I stop him from doing that, I'll, I'll still have a I'll have a chance to actually interrogate him. So we're going to do this mission here. So his name's Olgoth the Brander. So if we go into um, the map now, come out of this, go into the map. So there we go. That's the mission: the execution. So we need to invade his execution. So we'll make our way towards that, and then we can interrogate him once him we've killed all his friends and he's he's weak. All right, so here's the execution mission. I'm going to interrupt it, and we're going to get Olgoth the Brander. We're going to interrogate him and find out more about his um, his war chief that he's guarding. You betrayed your kind. Now you die. So we can press the Wraith button here, we can press R3, and we can look at what his weaknesses are. So his fear of Karagors, and he can be damaged more than any other enemy normally by finishers. So I just actually unlocked an ability, guys. Um, you know that dash attack we got with the bow? I've also got a finisher attack with that now. So instead of pressing X to dash to them, I'll press square, and that should be a finisher. So let's try that on him. Press square, shadow strike, kill. Whoa! That's ridiculously overpowered. Man, Mark him for death with the others. So this should be fairly easy. But this should, there's probably going to be a lot of enemies actually in, in the way. So that's a finisher attack there. That should hurt him quite a bit. So that there we go. He's um. That's the execution mission. He failed to execute them. But now we still need to get interrogate him to find more about the war chief. So it's not over yet. Let's grab him. Hopefully we will get won't get hit. Oh, it's such bullshit. Look at how oh, many enemies there are now. We've got to kill all these. So let's kill as many of these as we can. We'll do the special where we can do infinite executions just to get rid of them. Hopefully there won't be too many. There's actually a lot of enemies here, so this is pretty fun just to execute them all. You can see the meter in the bottom left there, that tells me how much time I've got left on this. Oh, what a cock! So, um, we need to grab him now. We've grabbed him. I think we need to hit him a bit first, to um, get him to this skull on his head to go green. That way you can interrogate. Okay, the coward goes up here, now he's scared. So it looks like he's trying to run away, so that should be actually not bad, because he'll take us away from the rest of the orcs. So let's get him around this corner a bit, then we'll grab him. Alright, let's interrogate him. This should be a good enough position. I see you. So if we gain intel now, we should be able to find out who the war chief is. This guy up here. Or maybe you can do it to them all. Maybe. I don't know. Let's do this guy anyway, because he's linked to him. So challenge Ad Asdush by rapidly slaying his Uruk. So, you just have to kill Oryx and he'll appear, I guess. His motive is insulting another Oryx honor to show off his power. See his weaknesses? Damaged by combat finishers. He's got a lot of strengths. I'm not, gonna, I'm not really going to look at them. Just um, focus on his weakness. So, if we rapidly kill loads of Oryx, that should call out that war chief. Okay, so that's the mission down there that will start the mission to um, give us the ability to call out that war chief. Alright, so here's the mission now to call out the war chief. So we'll jump in here. So hint, defeat the war chief's bodyguards before confronting him. That's just a hint. So if we rapidly kill the Oryx here, he should come out. Kill the Oryx with lightning speed to draw the war chief's thunder. Yeah, he's gonna get pissed in here if we... So kill five Oryx in 45 seconds. 
should be fairly doable. Start off with this guy. There's a guy up here. Headshot that guy. We've got three already. That's pretty good. I guess we can headshot this guy as well. Head the bow and arrow is so good. Oh, it's a ward. That's a um, captain. Hate of pain. <laughs> Oh no, we're kind of stuck in this little fight now. We may as well take this guy out first before we go for the war chief. Still gonna kill others. No, not him. Oh, the other guy. Oh, I'm getting in the way of everyone. Shit, that guy can't be countered. Oh, this is difficult. <laughs> Let's get the bone arrow out, and we'll just get headshots on these two guys. Just clear it up a little bit. There we go. So he's arrived. Shit. Okay, we'll take care of this guy first, and then we'll... <laughs> ah, it's douche! <laughs> so let's, let's fuck this guy up first. Let's fuck this guy up first. Alright guys, um, I just died, so because this um, we called the guy out already, I think he still will be there when we start the mission, so let's open this, and he should be available straight away. So he has arrived, there he is. The game and this, the difficulty in this game has all of a sudden just gone really hard. Once you've, it's the guys with shields that really do mess you up. So let's um before we kill him, we need to kill his other guys. So let's look at the weaknesses of these guys. Ah oh, no, we don't have the weakness. That's gay. What about the other guy? Okay, vulnerable to stealth finishes. Fear of more guy flies. So if we can get a stealth finish on this guy instantly, then we can just clear him. So let's try and get out the way a second. It's just, I think we are undetected anyway for the moment. So let's see which one he is. Is it that one? Yes, yeah, that one. Oh no, wrong guy. Shit! Let's climb back up there. <laughs> so we can see it's the guy on the left hand side out of the two captains. So let's jump onto this thing here quickly. Let's try and get him. Instant kill. Yes, nice. So that's made it a little bit easier. Now I'm going to take out the other captain. We've got this little piss about thing before we start fighting. Nothing can beat us. The cap the war chief is the big threat here, obviously. So we want to. We can't counter the cap the war chief. We can only um, evade him. So let's get a bone arrow on this guy, possibly. Take him up a bit quicker. Just a bit safer, I should say, not quicker. All right, he's having a little chit chat now. Rush, are you in such a hurry to die? Oh, screw you! When you get poisoned, guys, as well, like we are now, you can't see counters up here. Even though I'm not doing that well anyway, I defended them. So let's try and get this guy. Maybe we can kill him out with the bow. Nice, he's dead. So we've only got the war chief now, and this one other guy. I think the other guy's a berserker, which they're quite dangerous anyway. Probably just give him a headshot. Yeah, that'll do. Let's try and get him down before any reinforcements come. Come on, wreck him up. See, one on one, he's pretty easy. It's when you get all the other ones jumping in. See, look how much health he's got. This is nuts. Oh, there's another captain. Oh, this is so crazy. We've got to make some distance now, just to reassess the situation. Let's kill out, try and pop a few of these out. So we thin the numbers a little bit. Get the range guys as well. Execute him. Oh, fucking hell, this is nuts. Ah, uh, So we've got full health anyway, that's good. We've got no more arrows, so we could do it doing a drain finisher. 
Oh. You've always got to be jumping over heads here. Just to make sure you don't get hit. I'm going to do a drain finisher just to get some arrows. That's how you do it. Slow time down a bit as well. Pop a few of these heads. I'm going, every few hits, I'm just going to jump over the heads just to keep it safe. So this guy's almost dead. Let's see if we can finish him now. Not just yet. He's almost dead though. Hate of defeat. So he's got become berserked, I guess. See, he's regenerating health. That's such gay. Such bullshit. Let's see if we can get a bow and arrow in the head. Can we finish him, please? <laughs> this is nuts. Let's try and finish. Oh, we got the one guy. It's alright. He's a, he's a war chief. He's worth hitting. Should get him now. There we go. Off with your head. So the thing with doing doing combat on this guy is when it's this dangerous, you've just got to be patient. Take your time. You know, separate the numbers as well. I think. Oh, we haven't got that anyway. Um, let's finish it. Hopefully we can. He's got his own now because they all ran away because they were scared. So let's jump over his head first because he's got a shield. Let's get him on the ground. There we go. We got there in the end. <laughs> Freaking hell. It's actually a lot of fun once you get your rhythm. <laughs> Before that, it's so frustrating. Okay, guys, so we're going to go for another War Chief here. Try and, try and do all three of them in the same video if we can. So we got this guy on the right. He His bodyguards are this guy. And who's the other guy? This guy. Who's closest? This guy's probably closer. So we'll put a mark on him. He's our target. And we shall go find him. Alright, this is the guy we're looking for. He becomes terrified and he uh, is hitting another champion. That's weird. So he's still vulnerable to stealth. So hopefully we can... I oh, know we don't want to kill him, do we? We want to interrogate him, so we're not doing the stealth attack. Which is a shame. So we'll have to beat him down, and then we'll get the um, the interrogation done. Should be. There's not that many orcs around, so there's a few here. We may as well shoot the fire. You know, to um, just destroy all these quickly. So they're dead. And now we can start on this guy. Let's just... Let's do, a, do this first. <laughs> So when, once the skull above his head goes green, that's when we can um, execute. I mean, interrogate. Sorry. You're bold. I'll give you that and so much more. Okay, you can't really hit him that well. How'd you kill this guy? Ow. Let's jump back and do that uh, um, dash shot in. That seems to work. He's hard to kill this guy. There we go, he's gone green, so we can grab him. Let's just kill this guy first. Um I'll grab him. Let's interrogate. Let's find out where this war chief is. So he's linked to the guy on the top right. Here we go. New Intel land. Let's see what his weakness is. Mounted beast. Can be killed instantly. That's a good one. So if we can get a Caragor, we'll kill him instantly. Alright guys, this is the mission for killing the war chief in this uh, mission. So this guy, even though he's a he's like a tamer to some degree, 
his weakness is beasts, so we're gonna open a beast up and then jump on it, tame it, and we'll use it to kill him, hopefully. Should be able to do this one pretty quick. Hubris comes in taming nature. Release the war chief's caragors and expose his folly. So we got to release three caragors without raising the alarm. The caragors are here, right? Yeah, there we go. So let's open these cages. That's two of them already. Where's the other ones? I'm sure there's one in the middle somewhere. Can we go? Let's go a bit higher so we can get a better view. We can't set the alarm off here. I need to make sure. Oh, is that a cage down there? There we go. Um, hit it. Oh, there we go. So he's arrived. Let's get these elf shots on the wall there. So he's only got one captain with him, this one. If we can mount one of these Karagors, it'd be game over for him. Because all you got to do with that is knock him down with your sword, and then you can just have the um, Pest Triangle, and you'll just execute him with the Karagor. So we need to jump on a Karagor. Let's um, try and get one of these. We need to get close enough. And you can only do it from heights. You have to be above the Karagor. There we go. Just made that one. So let's tame it first. And now let's go get the cap, the war chief. So we just gotta knock him down, and then we'll um, we'll eat him alive. Well, this should be pretty simple. There we go. How easy was that? Instant kill on a war chief. That is sick. Yeah, boy. That's the quickest war chief killer you can probably ever get. <laughs> oh, this guy's killed the Karagor on that side as well. So he, he leveled up. Um, oh god. Let's kill this captain while we're here. That guy was um, a monster slayer, so he just killed the Karagor instantly. That was his special. Okay, we just got this other captain, and I think we can use him to actually identify one of the other war chiefs, but I don't think we'll get the weaknesses, that's the only problem. So, clicked on this guy. Oh, we can see his weaknesses, so he's damaged by combat finishers, and he's he's a pretty powerful bastard. Look at him, he's got a fucking skull on his head. Uh, someone else's head on his head. So, let's mark him as our target, and we'll make our way towards that mission. Alright guys, here we are, the next day, um, the final war chief we need to kill to complete the um, four war chief kills. Just walk past it, get back on there. Um, we need to challenge this, bring this guy out by not taking any damage. Ooh. What do we have to do though while not taking damage, I wonder? So let's accept this. Prove no weapon can touch us. Alright, kill 20 Oryx without taking damage. That's a lot of kills to get without taking damage. They don't die easy unless you finish them, you know? They're not like... you got to make sure you get the finishing hit on them. So, we don't need to do it in a combo or anything like that, so we may as well take a stealth approach to start. Let's take out any archers we see up above. Oh, that's a captain down there. Oh, free of burning, that's good. So he's going to be weaker. Let's see if we can jump on this guy from above. Oh, wrong guy. Oh well. Still chase him down, I guess. Oh, he's running off. He's just running away because he's scared. I think he takes more damage now as well. So we may as well finish this guy. If he doesn't keep running away like a little bitch. Let's grab him, actually. I should just grab him. Let's shank him. Oh, come on. I guess we can just um, grab him. Like this, some... I don't really need to get any intel, so I'm just going to choke him to death. Yeah, I'll do. That counts as one of the kills as well. We've got a few oaks. Is it explosive? No. I thought that was an explosive there, but it's not. It's just a crate. Let's head up here. Let's kill these guys. I'm very wary of not getting hit. 
my playstyle's changed a little bit. How many kills have we got? 11. There we go. 20 kills. Gunza. Gunza Head Chopper. It's not a good name, is it? <laughs> Let's see what his weakness is. Let's remind ourselves. Damage by combat finishes. So we make sure not to burn him because he'll become stronger. Let's do the arrow finisher where you dash in at him. Oh, that's, that's a ranged attack. That's not a ranged attack. Impressive, but every killing streak comes to an end. Shame. Let's do a finisher. There's not many enemies here, so that's good. Getting plenty of finishes on him here. He's almost done now. Gotta rush this kill, make sure no reinforcements come. So he's almost dead. My head. Really? So I need to do this little mini game. There we go. Off with your head. This helmet that came off of it. <laughs> so that's all the war chief's done. It was a bit of a bit of a struggle to start with, but once we got the flow of understanding how to take him on, pretty good. All right. So that's that mission complete, guys. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. That's the War Chiefs done. All four War Chiefs completed. So, whatever's next, we'll take that on in the next video. So, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.